Hello everyone and welcome to this Dragon Age Keep walkthrough. Now the Dragon Age Keep is officially in open beta. There's a link in the description where you can check it out. Try it for yourself. There's also a link where you can pre-order the game if you're interested. So with that said, let's begin. If you heard that sound, it was me pulling back my sleeve. So <laughs> there we go. Now the first thing we've missed actually was simply pushing the button to synchronize our data. Basically allowing the Keep to... Um, to import our saves from Dragon Age Origins and Dragon Age 2. I'm not quite sure how it does it, if we, like if we have many saves, for example. I'm not sure, but that's why the keep is here to customize our saves. So there we have it. First things first, it lets us choose our Grey Warden, our main character in Dragon Age Origins. Now, I believe since my latest save, I play Human Noble, it shows the Human Noble. Now, the name you can't actually change. You can change origin, class, or we can just pick it here. You get the default names. But basically, let's go with the human noble, Aiden Cousins. Oh, hold on. He is a warrior. Now, Dragon Age 2, there we play female mage, and we pick the female mage. Watch your story. I already made a video on it, so there should be an annotation anywhere on the screen. Go ahead and click it to see it. I'm going to skip it now. All right, here we are. So as you can see, there are all kinds of sections. There are notable DLCs, uh, Battle of Denerim, the Lands Meet. Let's go with the prologue first. We have the decision about the Ostigar prisoner. You remember that guy who had to be given food, I think? Killed, fed... Okay, uh, there we go. Fed Ostigar prisoner, stolen food. Uh, fed the prisoner with guards lunch, bought food to the prisoner. What I did was I took the guards lunch and um, let me zoom out a little bit. There we go. Took the guards lunch and gave it to the prisoner. So I choose this answer. The Mabari Hound. You can either cure it, you didn't help it or put it out of its misery. Unfortunately, I think I forgot to cure it. I only found the, um, the herb or whatever it was needed. So, But l let's go with the curing choice. All right. Uh, we go back. We click Dragon Age Origins. I think top left. Now, moving on to the... Uh, where is Lothering? Where is Lothering? This is Dragon Age 2. Is there no loadering in the thing? Hmm. That's interesting. Part where you recruit Liliana. And Stan. Hmm. Curious thing. Okay, let's see the Arl of Redcliffe. Okay, the Redcliffe fight. Um, we did help Redcliffe, so choosing this answer. Helping it prepare. Did the warden help the people of Redcliffe prepare for the attack of the undead? Yes. Well, what was the previous choice actually? Previous was. Oh, isn't that like the. Shouldn't it be the other way around? The preparation and then the fight itself? I don't know. Alright, let's see. Um, we did find him and he gave us the sword. Freed Bevan and returned the sword. I, I think we kept the sword. And took the sword. Yes, that's it. Right. We rescued the daughter of the blacksmith. And we... We cured Connor and freed him from his possession. So it should be this one. Right. Isold is alive. Yes, she is alive. Um, curious thing. Isold sacrificed herself. Would it tell me now that these two choices does not fit together? If I pick that Connor is alive and possessed. Okay, okay. So, yeah, it... it Offers me to create a new warden, I think. 
So yeah, okay, it works properly. Uh, Connor is alive and not possessed and... Did I say alive? I mean alive and not possessed and is old is alive too. And then Bella... Bella... Uh, who was that? Was that the innkeeper? Actually, not the innkeeper, but the, the waitress at the inn? Was that the waitress? Uh, I don't know what she did. My goodness. <laughs> let's, let's go for this one. I, I don't think I ever went back to speak to her last time. Okay. We have Ratcliffe. Now moving to... To where? Nature of the Beast. To the Daily Shelves. Okay, we brokered peace between them. The elves and werewolves. Um, did, didn't tell the hunter about his wife. Told him? Yeah, we told him. Now, it will be very curious if all of these choices have some sort of impact in Inquisition. Who knows? Um... We brought Iron Bark to this guy who made us something in return. I don't remember what. Kamen and Gaina. We made them marry each other. And we helped the Hala. Had to respect for that, but I did. Dagon. Who was Dagon? Was that the hunter elf we found? I think, yeah. And we escorted him back to camp. Okay. Moving back, moving to the mages. We did support the mages, proved the sensor. The first enchanter survived the battle, and we did not agree to Colin's request. Yeah, we did not. Okay, moving back. We're going to, 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 where shall we go? Let's go for the Urn of Sacred Ashes. Urn not poisoned. Yep, that's what we did. Surprisingly low amount of choices there. <laughs> okay. Then let's go visit the dwarves. A lot of stuff here. Again, it started... It starts from the ending. That's a weird order. We, um... Branca ended her own life? No. Joined forces with Caradin. Yes, that's what happened. Didn't talk to Dogna. We not only talked to her, but... Well, we can tell her that the circle is destroyed. We, um, Dagna left to study. I'm guessing that means into the circle. Okay. Um, did the Wardens have relations with Mardi before being cast out of Ozimar? Nope. Horomont rules Ozimar, yes. Um, feel that I was the one who was looking for her son. We told her the truth about Rock. Didn't prove Legion of the Dead connected to Noble House. I don't remember. Did the Warden prove to the Shapred that the Legion of the Dead was connected with a Noble House? Did I? I, I don't think I did. Um... I, I proved that another dwarf has links to a noble house, Orta, I think, the Orton, Orton Tig and all that, but I don't think... Let's go for didn't prove. Okay. Didn't look into return to the tomb to Shepherd, that's what I did. Did I say Shepherd? I meant Shaper it. Too much Commander Shepherd. Did the Warden help... Uh, oh, the Chantry, yeah, I did find... I did create a Chantry in Orzammar. Which ended up badly. Spoiler alert. 
what was the fate of um, this was the castless woman right I think I told her to seek help um, yeah to the surface um, lyrium deal projects lyrium deal I don't remember let's go for didn't complete it oh yeah there we go didn't help Orta to join the assembly I helped her by proving that yeah she's a member of house or town exactly so uh, that's what I remembered but nothing really about the Legion of the Dead might once again be a dwarf specific choice don't quote me on that but there we go okay we continue to um to where perhaps let's see what's in the hero section um no we don't need that i think let's go companions okay we romanced alistair i guess it will uh, allow me to pick a new character if I choose that because it's not a male romance. We romance the Lena. Recruited dog, yes. Oh, the uh, choices on loitering are here. Look, with Stan. So never mind the loitering part. What did the warden do about Stan's imprisonment? We freed him. Persuaded the mother to free Stan. Yes, we recruited him. Um... Stan's sword, he has his sword and he didn't leave. We recruited Win. Win alive and well? Didn't she die in a book? But whatever. She's alive and well. Morgan did not have a baby. That she didn't. Uh, nope. Sorry. You didn't have a baby. Zevron, he's recruited. He's alive and well. Alistair became king. Warden and Alistair were not lovers. <laughs> we were not. Yeah, that's again for a female warden. Did not acquire, acquire the Grimoire. No, we did acquire. Acquire the Grimoire peacefully. By defeating Fleming, we did. Well, it was kind of a. She forced herself to be defeated, but there you go. We defeated her. Liliana alive and well. Ah, uh, yeah, I'm not going to comment on that. Um, nothing to address my epilogue. I'm sad. But oh well, that was expected. You can see the link on the screen right now to um, learn more about what I'm talking about she's alive and well there we go okay um, what else is left here Nathaniel alive and well he is Logan executed by warden true and that's it about the companions now the stone prisoner dlc everyone's alive no one is possessed shell is alive and well and shell recruited yes moving on to the lands meet did we go to Arl of Redcliffe? Yeah, I think so. The lands meet. Alistair and Honora rule. Battle of Denerim. The warden killed the archdemon. Um, yeah, that's it. Warden's Keep DLC. Um gained power of blood i did gain it to allow me to run faster and sophia she was killed 
and we allowed awareness ethical research yeah i think that's what we did okay going back to witch hunt dlc of which i'm making videos tomorrow spoiler alert spoiler alert um didn't go through the Illuvian. we didn't go through the Illuvian. let's take a look at the awakening expansion now so few choices recruited Ogren, yes oops an error occurred please refresh the page um i didn't think i clicked anything but there, there we go did Ogren reunite with his wife and child Did we protect the keep? Yes, we managed to. What are the choices? Okay, now it's not working. Let me try to refresh the page. All right, we're back. Let's see what choices we have here. Amaranthine protected, keep and Amaranthine protected. Yes, we did protect both. We did not kill the architect. And there we go. Moving on to Dragon Age 2. Dragon Age 2, okay, I'm starting my Dragon Age 2 videos tomorrow, so if you don't want spoilers, don't watch it. And there we have it. Okay, hero. Marion Hawk, she was, I guess, mostly humorous. Oh, I had to click Dragon Age 2 over here, yep. Act 1. Okay, what did did I do with the Templars? I convinced them to leave or to... I think I fought them. Yeah, I stood with the mages. If if it's talking about that cave... My god, I, I, I don't like Dragon Age too much. And to be honest, I don't... I probably don't remember half the things I did. Um, didn't return cargo to Martin. I think we did. Yeah, I think I returned him to the magistrate. We did return Seamus to the Viscount. Um, Danzig. Um, yeah, we left him alive. Didn't look for, um... Oh, the truth about his wife. Yeah, we returned the ring. We, yeah, we told the truth, exactly. Didn't solve Mystery of the Miners. I did solve it, yeah. Dragon was behind it all. Blackmailed Sir Thrask. We didn't blackmail him. Iduna killed. Was that the... Yes, yes, she was killed. Sent Fainreel to the Dalish. Um, yes, we sent him to the Dalish. Had some issues for that. Okay, Kiran, who was that guy? Oh, I think I remember, the blonde guy. Yeah, he returned to the Templars. Um, then uh, Ketogen, um, was that the, the Kunari mage? I think if, if so, we defended him from the Kunari, yes. Karas, alive and well. Uh, yeah, we killed him. We sided with Thrask, if I remember correctly. That was when we got out of the cave and we wanted to save the mages, so yeah. Alright, going to Act 2. Um, killed Gascard. Uh, Gascard Dupree? Uh, we didn't kill him. Did Hawk side with Varnell against the Kunari. Um, no, we didn't. 
didn't side with Patrice yes um, how did Hawk help I don't think I did that I certainly don't remember this guy nor his son in the deep roads so I'm gonna go with didn't help him Javaris died did Javaris die no he's alive and well hope that was the right choice all right Lieutenant Harley with the raiders on the cliffs um, I think we fought alongside the guardsmen here the Arishok is killed Fenrir freed um, yep he left okay what's left now oh we skipped the prologue um, yeah we joined the smugglers not much here did we go for hero uh, yes companions now no one romanced indeed Bethany died while escaping loathering yes Kava became a Templar Bartrand killed nope help Varric discover the cause of haunting yes Varric did not keep the idol indeed uh, Bethan did not live, yes. Fenris alive and well. We did recruit Isabella. Isabella did not return to Hawk, yes. Meryl stayed with Hawk. She's alive and well. She did not destroy the Illuvian. Isabella didn't give the thing to Arishok. I mean... Uh, we didn't give Isabel to the Irish shock. Didn't approve of Anders' actions exactly. Anders executed. Meryl's clan was killed. Aveline indeed married Donick. She stayed with Hawk. Didn't make Talos angry. I, I don't think I played the um, Felicia Day DLC so I'm just gonna go with didn't make her angry didn't kiss her we recruited Sebastian though um, Hulk, Hulk and Colm were not friends well we were friends I guess friends with Varric indeed strange enough I don't have any options for what I did to Sebastian but there we go oh, what did I click okay moving back to chapter 3 or act 3 okay this part I actually skipped this part in my playthrough um, but because I was rushing but now I'm gonna go with I helped him and that I um, I found Zevron, I, I let him go. I skipped Nathaniel as well, but I'm gonna go with the fact that I helped him. Okay, um, I handed the conspirators to Orsino. That is towards the end. I allowed Emil to go free. The mage who didn't want to die a virgin. Um, I sided with the mages. Let Keran go and killed the dragon at the bone pit right is there anything else now well, there is the legacy dlc we found malcolm's will there we go and we sided with larias 
even though what was her name Janica yeah she had the voice of Sidonia my Sith warrior but sorry I couldn't so there you have it I do believe that is the entirety of the Dragon Age keep now I think we can play a story again which I'm not gonna do and we can share our world state we'll say Exletalis world state There we go, shared it, and that was it, I hope you enjoyed this rather lengthy video of a complete first time walkthrough of me through the Dragon Age Keep, tell me what you think about it, don't forget to check the description for a link to the Keep's beta and to the pre-order of the game if you enjoyed the Dragon Age series and want to play Dragon Age Inquisition, thank you very much for watching, stay tuned and be good.